history of the Marvel Universe, it comprises literally what it says on the package. The entire history of what happened in the Marvel Universe from the Big Bang, the dawn of time, until the eventual heat death of the universe at the other end. Well, the goal, obviously, is to cover as much of the history of the Marvel Universe as you can, but there's no fun if it's just a 120-page Wikipedia entry. It's more fun when you find little nuggets of history that maybe, as a reader, you didn't really know because maybe we haven't quite told you yet. Beyond the fact that it's the story of everything, there is actually a bit of a narrative that runs through, which involves Franklin Richards and Galactus preparing for the final days of this universe and reflecting back on all of the stuff that has happened. It's a series made not just for hardcore Marvel fans, although they will love it. If there's anything you loved about the Marvel Universe, it's in this book somewhere. But it's also an entry, a start here, for brand new fans. Javier Rodriguez is doing all of the art. He's bringing such a great sense of design and scope and spectacle to it. It really is a visual cornucopia. You'll be able to stare at these pages for hours at a time and find new things that are in it. Every page is bursting with action. Every page is bursting with energy. The Marvel Universe is so big. It's the largest, longest, continuing narrative story in the history of mankind. The Marvel Universe is a living thing. It is its own story. So just because you think you know the history of the Marvel Universe doesn't mean you know the history of the Marvel Universe.